Ukrainian intelligence chief advocates for 100 kilometers buffer zone with Russia. Earlier, Russia expressed its willingness to engage in dialogues with Ukraine to resolve the ongoing conflict. Kirill Budinov, a leading Ukrainian intelligence officer, has suggested the formation of a 100 km wide demilitarized zone separating Ukraine and Russia. As the head of Ukraine's Defense Ministry's main intelligence directorate, Budinov voiced his views on the Ukrainian Islandia, Iceland, Mirror African TV. To resolve the conflict, we aim to establish a demilitarized zone, stated Budinov. When asked to clarify the logistics of this proposed zone, Budinov suggested, such a zone would be invulnerable to typical forms of attack. He went on to add, in my opinion, this would definitely be an appropriate distance. Despite Russia's earlier claims of being open to dialogue with Ukraine to find a resolution to the conflict, the Russian Foreign Ministry spokeswoman Maria Zakharova has highlighted some impediments to these discussions. Zakharova pointed out that Ukrainian President Vladimir Zelensky's law, enacted on September 30, 2022, which legally prohibits negotiations with Russian President Vladimir Putin, has been a significant hurdle. Furthermore, she criticized Zelensky's measures, claiming they demonstrate a total disconnect from contemporary realities, including the insistence on the removal of Russian military forces from newly claimed regions of Ukraine. On February 9, Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov asserted that Russia perceived no genuine willingness from Ukraine to engage in serious discussions on a peaceful settlement.